Not only is this ground beef stir fry so easy to make, it is so delicious. The ground beef with the vegetables and rich sauce all combined together is such an amazing combination of flavors. First, you're gonna wanna go ahead and make the stir fry sauce. In a bowl, combine two third cup beef broth, one third cup soy sauce, we like to use low sodium, one and a half teaspoon sesame oil, one tablespoon cornstarch, three tablespoons brown sugar, and just whisk that together until it is well combined. Next, we're gonna wanna go ahead and prep the vegetables. We're just gonna slice the red and green pepper into thin, even strands. julienne that carrot we like to just cut it into three equal parts and then once that is cut slice it and then cut the slices into thin julienne strips The mushrooms may either be quartered, sliced, or finely chopped, whatever your personal preference is. A green onion may be cut into larger pieces like we did. They can also be cut into thin slices. In a skillet, heat one tablespoon oil over high heat. Once the skillet is hot, you're gonna wanna go ahead and add that ground beef. Saute of breaking it up until it is browned and no longer pink. Season the ground beef with salt and pepper to taste. Give it a good stir and remove it from the skillet. Add two tablespoons butter to the same skillet and add all of your vegetables. Then cook them until they are desired doneness. We like our vegetables on the firmer side so we don't keep it on as long. But if you like your vegetables tender, just keep cooking until they reach the doneness that you like. I want to go ahead and add that minced garlic, give the vegetables a stir, and cook just until it becomes nice and fragrant. And now it's time to add that cooked beef back to the skillet, give it a stir, and we're going to pour in the sauce. And we're just going to cook that for about one to two minutes, allowing the sauce to get nice and thick and all of those flavors to penetrate into the rest of the ingredients. That ground beef is so tender and flavorful combined with the vegetables and sauce and green onion. Oh, such a perfect combination of flavors. And now it is time to serve our dish. You can serve this over plain rice, you can serve it over pasta, you can serve it over quinoa, whatever your favorite side is.